okay let us move to the next complicated problem will be uh, demonstrated how that can be uh, constructing DFA right so look at that the statement will be like this construct a DFA which accepts a set of all string of zeros and ones having at least three consecutive zeros three consecutive zeros is important point of this problem statement in this case I need to construct a DFA what is that it accept all zeros and ones it is a input alphabet but condition is that it should any string is generated from that input alphabet it should at least contain three, three zeros then let us point out what is the minimum string is required minimum string is required is three zeros right so three zeros it required look at this three zeros I have written here zero 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 so that will be the minimum string then for that you have to construct the minimal DFA for it basic string first you have to construct it I will take the as you told that is state is represented by circle and that will be the initial state so first it is on the Q0 first here it is the first state is will be the the initial state on 0 it will go to the next state it will go to the next state it will go to the next state that is 0 again what is the next input here the next input also 0 so that I will accept it 0 and again it will go to the next state so that is finally if you have one more 0 that also will be go to accepting 0 on it will go to the next state then you in order to make these three zeros are accepting it the final circle should be double circle that will be the accepting state now this minimal string it is three zeros it make that is a dfa it is accepted it is accepted let us see next possible string what is the next possible string one zero 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 right so anyway it is having a three consecutive at least three consecutive zeros before to that it can have any number of ones right any number of ones then again you have to start with a initial state it can have any number of ones at beginning right that will also made it accepted what is the next possible string look at this it may be three zero 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 one so it is already start from the initial state zero is there zero is there zero is there it is go to the accepting state but we have still input buffer I have one more one is there so that you have to made it accepting it so because you already achieved the three zeros so at the end you have to accepting one right it can have comes any number of ones at the end right so that also accepted right but you may not know any combination it can comes in between the three the uh, this four state right let us see the next possible string so this also uh, uh, it's a value string because it is contains a three consecutive either at the beginning or at the end or at the middle right look at this this also it is a value string you have to made it accepting it right so there is already we have started with a zero we have a transition from the start state all the three zero accepted go to the the four state we have a one more zero so it can be ended with already so any number of zero at the end right right so it can have a one more zero at the uh, over the loop on fourth state okay so this is also possible because this string also has a three consecutive zeros let us see that already zero has come okay we have a zero but already we have a transition from the initial state zero go to the next state we have a transition one but the state two state two we not we are not having a transition on one so we have to create it if at all if you create the transition on on the state to itself it will accept e1 it is a two consecutive zero but so that should not create the end here it is wrong dfa so that is you have to come back to the start state now again three zeros will be achieved let us see that another possible string this also value string right zero zero but there is a goal uh, once you reach after two zeros third state we have a one more transition one but 
here it is have a zero transition is there one is missing it again you have to come back on one to starting state on one to starting state okay let us move to the next transition so on so on that so every look at that how do you ensure that all the possible string is accepting every state have a transition on every input let us take the first state of initial state every transition on 1 and 0 look at the second state 0 and 1 look at the third state 0 and 1 and the fourth state also have a 0 and 1 so that means every state have a transition on every input then it is complete dfa it is accepting the any number of zeros and ones having at least three consecutive zeros i hope you that you understood this problem so let us see how do you demonstrate that so all this first string can take that i will be animated a sum of this string whether it is be transition it okay tracing it i will take one three zeros here I'll start with the the first starting state first and zero will go to the second state then one zero we have consumed it then we have a two more uh, zeros at the time you are at the second state then again we'll move on to the third state of on zero then we have only one zero at the moment or at the third state again there is a one more transition from third state to fourth state there is a zero now at that moment all the zeros are over you are at the accepting state then it is a given string accepted let me will take one more a better understanding will say animating one more string i'll take here zero one zero 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 right first of all it is zero is has come one zero is over right there is a one i have a one right the one one is also accepted at the moment you are at the beginning state then on three more zeros are there that will be the linear case it will all zero is accepting it look at it right so how that will be processing here now that also accepted with this i hope you that clear understanding of this problem is there any doubt please you have to be please comment this okay which is at if you complete that diagram writing it is enough to get the full marks of it no you have to be clear complete the rest of the m description what is dfa it is dfa defined by phi tuples that is denoted by m q sigma q naught delta f then you have to describe them with respect to this diagram so what is q here so q has q naught q1 q2 q3 then sigma is 0 comma 1 and q naught belong to q is a start state then f is a q3 is a subset of capital q then q cross sigma to q is a transition function then that will be uh, represented in transition table look at that as you told that is a final state is represented by star q3 is a star right so then then here it is you can final state is this initial state will be arrow mark okay so this is the one best example please any doubt have to be comment right thank you